Hey ladies and gentlemen, Michelle McPherson here and we're going to be doing another edition of Steal This Niche today. I'm going to walk you through using my favorite keyword research tool to find a niche that is profitable, that I can master, and that I can make some money from. So we need to find a keyword and we need to find a product that we can sell to people interested in that keyword. So let's go over to the computer and take a peek. So I was up late the other night couldn't sleep and ended up watching some infomercials. One of them was about a particular health problem that they claim 80% of Americans have, and it's called adrenal fatigue. And it may, according to them, cause you to feel tired all the time, to put on weight that you can't lose, uh, lack of energy, that kind of thing. So health, it's always a good niche. People have problems. Also, this thing is on TV, right? And people just like me are out there watching it. So there's going to be other people other than me who saw it and then maybe go to their web browser and go to find some more information about it. And maybe there's a supplement or something like that that you can sell. So I'm going to uh, look up adrenal fatigue in Market Samurai. And this should be a good niche because like I said, it's, it's on air. Um, and then I'm going to do my keyword research phrase length should be two at least. And I'm also going to do Google search keywords and then generate. And uh, I'll get a captcha here and I'll enter that. And then Market Samurai will return a bunch of keywords for me. And we can then filter those down by competition. Okay, so we've got our adrenal fatigue keywords. Let's run over here and we'll do a phrase to broad. Let's go with 15. We want to get rid of anything that doesn't have a 15 phrase to broad or a uh, or lower and we want SEO traffic I'm gonna say at least 10 I want a lot more than that but sometimes I just like to see the numbers for keywords that are lower and then we're gonna run our SEO competition by clicking analyze keywords and it's gonna go fetch that data for us all right so I'm gonna set my SEO competition max to 150,000 I really prefer for something to be under a hundred thousand but if it's like 101 I might go for it um, adrenal fatigue itself is a little high 240,000 SEO competition uh, but the searches per day is huge, so that's a big deal. Let's see what else we've got here that has high traffic. Fatigue symptoms, adrenal stress. That was another keyword that they actually mentioned in that video, or sorry, in that infomercial. So that is very interesting. It has a low SEO competition being 46,000, and the SEO traffic is 204. So let's take a look at the SEO competition for the keyword phrase adrenal stress and see what we can come up with. Let's see how this market samurai grid looks for us. All right, so this grid looks okay in some ways and not in others. Most of our backlinks to the domain are fairly high-ish. Our lowest one is 154 and most of them are in the thousands. Backlinks to the page looks great. We've got very few with high backlinks to their page. Our PR is okay. We've got some high PR sites, uh, but those are YouTube videos. And we've got one that has a PR of zero. Domain age is a little higher than I like to see. I do prefer to see some sites that have a lower domain age, but we do have one that has a domain age of three. The rest of the stuff, title tags and all that, all looks really, really good. So this is a keyword that I would absolutely look at. Now I'm gonna go back over to the main adrenal fatigue page and see if there's anything else that really interests me. Um, adrenal support, possibly, that's got 76,000 SEO competition, and I think that uh, that keyword phrase is looking for people, or people are looking for uh, supplements and stuff to support their adrenal function. So that may actually be a good, like, buying keyword. Adrenal exhaustion is very similar to adrenal fatigue, so let's look that one up too, and I'm going to check out, check out the SEO competition grid on this as well and see if it looks any better than adrenal stress looked. We still have some high domain ages as it looks like. Uh, PR is better. We've got a site in number two with a zero PR. Backlinks to the page is okay. Backlinks to the domain are all fairly high. Uh, but I wouldn't say an absolute no to this, but I do think that I like adrenal stress better just because it has a lower link profile overall. Now the last step, well, let's look and see if there's one more keyword here. Um, adrenal health, that's a very general uh, term. 
that could be, I, I've seen like adrenal cancer, adrenal tumor. So adrenal health could apply to adrenal fatigue people as well as uh, people who have more serious problems like with cancer and stuff. So that may give a site quite a bit to talk about um, as far as different blog posts and stuff like that. But this we're looking at really high domain ages, but our backlinks to the pages are low. Uh, again, I think I would still go with adrenal stress overall out of all of these keywords that we're looking at. And I could continue to go down this list if I wanted to, because we're still working. We're at, uh, you know, 91 visitors a day, which is perfectly acceptable in terms of developing a site around that particular keyword phrase, because you have to think not only about your main keyword phrase, but also you're going to be able to get traffic from those secondary keyword phrases that are related to it and that you write posts about. Now, the last thing that I want to check for is that there are actually affiliate products that I can work with in this niche. So I've typed in adrenal stress affiliate and we're going to see what we find. evitamins.com looks like it has um, a 60 capsule product and they do have an affiliate program. Uh, Vitanet Online looks like it has an affiliate program. Optimal Health Network has a test to see if you have adrenal stress and they have an affiliate program. So it looks like there are absolutely supplements that can be sold to people as well as the test itself and there are affiliate programs in this niche. So of all of those keywords, uh, I do like the adrenal stress keyword the best. It's got a pretty good grid here and it also has high searches. You'll get 204 visitors a day at the number one position in Google and fairly low competition at 46,000. So this is an excellent niche to get into. Good luck with it. Thank you so much. This is Michelle McPherson and we'll talk soon.